welcome back to my online class my dear all students how are you now during covid 19 i hope you are all set staying home we all know our college has been closed down during to covid 19 a pandemic globally to continue our education we have launched online class before some days i think you will follow my class and continue your learning platform okay so let's start my class i am md farooq hussain farhad assistant professor of english sharsha bujola college sharsha joshor my dear all students today's class is right form of verbs the right form of verbs is a part of your syllabus in english second paper so please follow my class and take instructions from me here we see right form of verbs rules please follow first verb of a sentence indicates verb plus ing example teach is a noble profession do you think what is the answer yes answer is teaching this is used as before a sentence at first a sentence so answer is teaching so let's watch in the next slide Another rule is subject third person singular indicates verb s or es. So we know if the subject is third person singular, s and es will be added with the verb. Here, follow an example: A teacher teaches his students from the core of heart. What is the answer? Yes. answer is a teacher teaches here a teacher is third person singular so answer is teaches so my dear all students please note down the rules of right form of verbs and practice it regularly so let's watch in the next slide subject third person plural indicates verb present form The students learn their lessons hitfully. The students learn here. The students subject third person plural. So answer is learn. Here, red color word shows answer. Please follow. Next, two indicates verb present form. Two indicates verb present form. So you know, after two, verb present form is used in a sentence. The students study hitfully to acquire higher education. What is the answer? Yes, answer is to acquire. The students study hitfully to acquire higher education. Here some rules. some words in the, including with a view to look forward to get used to and be used to be means is are or were used to indicates verb plus ing please watch an example a teacher teaches his students with a view to give the light of education do you think what is its answer yes Answer is a teacher teaches his students with a view to give him the light of education. Please follow another example. The old man is used to walk. Answer is used to walking. The old man is used to walking in the morning. 
So my dear all students, let's watch in the next slide. Except to all prepositions indicate verb plus ing. Here we have used some prepositions including in, for, one, by, with, against, within, from, after, before, of, into, beyond, through, etc. Example, by get the light of education, student need attention. The answer is by getting. By getting the light of education, students need attention. Another example, we can uplift our mind through such knowledge throughout the world. Do you think? What is its answer? Yes. Answer is searching. Answer is searching. Please note down the rules and practice it regularly staying home. So now let's watch in the next slide. Model auxiliaries. Here we see some model auxiliaries including can, could, may, might, shall, should, will, would, must, need, used to, what to, had better, would rather indicates verb present form. Please follow the examples. The students can enlighten their inside and outside. The answer is students can enlighten. So here can is model of the verb. So after model of the verb, verb present form is used in a sentence. So another example, we want to love our country. Answer is we want to love. Here, what to is model auxiliary verbs. So let's pause in the next slide. Be, being, having, getting, had indicates the past participle. Please follow the example. Water is being contaminated day after day. Here answer is water is being contaminated day after day. So answer is being contaminated. So verb past participle will be used after being. Please ask the next example. Simple sentence it contains two verbs. Bracket verb ing two plus verb present form. Please follow the example. The players come back home win final match. Here, come back is a verb and another win is a verb. So what is its answer? Answer is winning or to win. Winning or to win. So my dear all students, let's watch in the next slide. Complex and compound sentence contain two verbs. Please follow the example. Water is an inevitable element which helps us in various ways. Water is an inevitable element which helps us in various ways. Here answer is helps because water is main subject and it is complex sentence. Water is third person singular. So after third person singular we know yes or yes with the verb is used in the sentence. Let's see another rules. It is high time we stop smoking. So you know it is high time, it is time. Verb indicates past tense. So it is high time we stop stopping picking. It is high time we did it, we did our lesson. It is high time we completed our homework. It is high time we avoided 
bad company and another examples my dear all students let's watch in the next slide not plus verb indicates do not does not did not plus verb present form here follow the example there are many people who not take physical exercise there are many people who do not take here do not means subject plural does not means subject third person singular did not means subject past tense and sentence past tense here please follow do not means subject singular plural subject plural does not means subject singular and did not means sentence past tense please follow the example there are many people who not take so answer is do not take here people is antecedent and people is plural so answer will be do not take so let's us in the next slide passive mood please follow the examples water pollute in different ways so we know passive mood means when subject is inactive then the sentence will be passive mood when subject is inactive then will be the passive mood so please follow the examples water pollute in different ways here answer is water is polluted because this sentence is passive mood water can pollute in different ways water can be polluted in different ways this is passive mood another example is the room will oblique has decorated with festoons so answer is is decorated or has been decorated or was decorated or will be decorated or had been decorated the subject varies different answers so now let's watch in the next slide the room has decorated with festoons the room has been decorated here the room has been decorated with festoons is passive mode the room decorated with festoons the room was decorated with festoons is passive mode so let's watch in the next slide past indicating words including once ago long ago since last yesterday last year last night etc here the word indicates past tense here we see the example last year we visit paharpur so answer is visited another example is i dream a sweet dream last night so i dreamed a sweet dream last night here answer is dreamed so in these two sentences we see last night and last year is past indicating word so past indicating word shows the sentence is past tense here we see some rules before past perfect plus past tense after past plus past perfect tense please follow the rules and note down please please follow the example the patient died before the doctor came so answer is the patient had died so past perfect is used before and past perfect is used after the patient had the patient died after the doctor come the patient died after the doctor had come so my dear all students 
let's see in the next slide before main verb if prepositions whereas remains added passive mode will be set up so here we see before main verb if prepositions or as remains added passive mode will be set up now follow the example dowry dash regard as cancer in our society so here we see as so as is used before verb the sentence will be passive mode so here answer is is regarded initiative a state should take so hence answer is should be taken so here are some rules i have shown you so in the next class the rest rules i will give you so thank you very much my dear all students i think you will keep well and stay home and pray for me so see you and i'll see you in the next slide thank you very much thank you very much Okay. Mm -hmm.